What's happening everybody? Jay Shockblast here and check it out. Our second Deadpool item of the evening. Uh, this I believe is from Diamond Select. Um, it is the gallery version of Deadpool. Now, really surprisingly, I got this at Best Buy of all places. They're going, everybody's going hard after collectibles. Uh, Target has a new collectible section in their gaming area, and Best Buy even has one in their gaming. Yeah, it's Diamond Select Toys. Um, so this is a PVC statue of Deadpool. Uh, Smart Alec Mercenary Wade Wilson discovered the one target he could not kill when he was diagnosed with cancer. Promised a cure by Canada's Weapon X program. If he agreed to undergo an experimental medical procedure, Wilson was given a powerful healing factor that allows him to heal from any injury, except the hideous scarring that covers every inch of his body. The healing factor also affects the, neur the neurons in his brain, causing erratic behavior, mood swings, and irrational beliefs. It also causes his movements to be highly unpredictable, making him difficult to defeat in hand-to-hand -hand combat. Combat. This 9-inch scale Marvel Gallery PVC diorama of Deadpool is based on his appearance in Marvel Comics and features a high level of detail and exacting paint applications. Sculpted by Jean St. John. Uh, so there it is. Um, I don't love the pose, but it was 45 bucks, and it's Deadpool, so bought it. Um... I just can't believe they're selling something like this at Best Buy of all places. Um, so, yeah, just trying to open this thing up on the top up here. Uh, I actually, I like to think that I stay pretty on top of things. This is like the most indestructible tape ever. Um, I, but I like to think I stay on top of things, all things Deadpool. I had no idea this was even a thing. I don't think I've... Wow. This, like, does not want to open. Alright. So, um... Sorry, it's kind of hold a, hard to hold the camera and open it at the same time. It's a very big box. And... Uh, not the best packaging, not gonna lie. Packaging is really freaking weird. Um... Kind of like this awkward, like, papery stuff on the inside that kind of gets in the way. So, um, let's get this out of the way. And also compounding things is my little tripod is dying on me. Uh, so, there's the package insert. This is uh, licensed from Diamond Select. Got a little business card you can send in to Hunt Valley, Maryland. Yeah, so they've got a huge line of these, uh, mostly females. Um, you've got Captain Marvel, you've got Jane Foster, you've got Lady Deadpool, which I have something similar to that. You have Spider Gwen, you have Medusa, and then there is Hulk, and there is Ant Man. And, oh, you've got some other ones. Uh, you've got Gamora, you've got another Spider-Gwen, you got Rogue, classic Rogue, you have the real Thor, and you have Wolverine. Those are rests in statues, so. Um, the Gamora looks pretty cool, I like that one, so. Anyway, let's uh, bust this bad boy out of his, of course, there's tape down here, and up there. So. All right. So, there is his knee. Back him up a little bit. See if we can't get a... Unfortunately, my camera is, like, trying to fall. Alright. So, there's a good look. Oh, come on. Get in focus. I don't know why you won't get in focus. There we go. Uh, 
this camera is, it does good quality usually, but I don't know why it won't focus on him. Anyway, um, there are two swords. I just have to get out of the package. I, I like doing unboxing videos, but I hate it when the packaging is so big. It just makes it really hard and awkward to actually do the unboxing. Um, because, like, unless you're doing this massive, you know, like a massive table or desk, um, there's just no good way to, to do this. So, there's sword number one. There's sword number two. Eventually. Alright, let's try this over. Maybe there's a certain way to do it. Alright, so if you have a hard time, uh, the swords, I guess, are specific. So, alright. And there he is. For 45 bucks, I mean, this is pretty awesome. I'm not gonna lie, it's a really cool pose. I don't know what the fire effect is down here, but um, for comparisons purposes, there's the Scotty Young Gentle Giant figure back there. That was 65. This one was 45. And it just does not want to stay in focus. So. Really, really cool pose. Um, I mean, this is this is great for the price. I mean, this is an awesome collectible that you can add to your collection at a solid price. I mean, something like this, if it was anything other than PVC, would probably cost you at least $150 to $200. If it was like a Retson, Retson statue, uh, something of that nature. So, I, like I said, I got mine at Best Buy. You should be able to get this at like basically any comic store. Uh, Diamond Select is uh, pretty big, so they're a very huge distributor. Um, but I got mine at Best Buy, so I got you know reward points and everything for it. Yeah, that's awesome. So uh, be on the lookout from Diamond Select Toys, the 9-inch Deadpool gallery figure, statue, whatever you want to call it. I uh, hope you guys enjoy the video. We'll see it.